hey guys i hope you're doing well and welcome back to another video so this is a very quick tip about editing your assets in unreal let's say that you have a lot of assets including static meshes or textures and you want to edit something in all of them you can open them one by one edit them and save which is a very tedious job or you can select them all right click go to asset actions and go to edit selection in property matrix here in the details panel you have access to all of the settings of your static meshes next in this pinned columns tab you can add these settings to these columns here so for example in the nanite settings i want to be able to add this enabled or disabled nanite to these settings so all you need to do is to just hit this button here and now you can enable and disable nanite for the meshes you want so for example let's say that i want to have nanite for my factory columns i'm gonna select them all here check enable and now here you can see that i have nanite for these meshes here you can also check or uncheck them like this as well another useful setting is this light map resolution when you want to bake your lighting you need to adjust your light map resolution for all of your meshes so again you can just hit this and now you can edit all of these together all at once the last thing i want to mention is that it does not work for materials so if you select them all go to your asset actions you cannot find batch editing property matrix but it will work for textures so for example let's say that you want to downscale the textures in your project so you have better performance again you can open them one by one and here search for max texture size and downscale them like this or you can open them up in your property matrix here search for max texture size and then add this to the columns and then define the maximum texture size you want to use for your textures yeah that's it guys for this video and i hope you learned something new from this tutorial thank you guys for watching see you in the next one